In a time when female physicians were nearly unheard of, Mary Edwards Walker proved that women were ambitious, intelligent, and interested in the complex field of medicine. She was raised by a free-thinking family of farmers, abolitionists, and suffragists who themselves lived outside of conventional norms. One such norm-breaking rule would stay with Mary all her life, wearing pants. Working on the farm in Oswego, New York, her parents insisted that she dress practically for her duties. She would continue to wear the style of reform dress or a suit during her career as a physician, stating, I don't wear men's clothes, I wear my own clothes. As the only woman in her class, she earned her medical degree at Syracuse Medical College in 1855. Not long after, she decided her skills ought to be used to help Union soldiers of the American Civil War. It was a long and challenging road for Dr. Walker during the war, from constant criticism and insults to even being a prisoner of war for four months. Yet, through it all, she insisted on providing her much-needed skills and would eventually be recognized for it with the Medal of Honor. To this day, she is the only woman to have received this award. On Tuesday, July 13th at 7 o'clock, the Northeast Georgia History Center will present part two of its Summer Chautauqua series, Healthcare Heroes. Meet Dr. Mary Walker, portrayed by Sue McRaney, and hear her fascinating story.